hi my name is victoria welcome to my channel i have lost weight using optavia i wanted to give you a quick update on my weight loss this video is primarily on fuelings that i'll be sharing with you but i did reach my goal weight i changed it to 145 pounds i reached 145 pounds and i'm currently in transition i do intend on doing another video to share with you my transition and my weight loss. And at that time, I will also share with you my weight loss charts from my beginning weight at 269 to my ending weight and my weekly weigh-ins in between. I showed you in one of my previous videos how to make a very low calorie vegetable soup. But I do realize that we don't always have time to do that. And I had a goal to go to the store and find a soup that I could just grab and quickly heat up in the microwave. Progresso has a line of lightened up soups, and I found that a few of them work for me for fuelings, so I will share that with you, in addition to some that are more whole foods and will take a little bit more time. So we'll have a mixture today of whole foods, summer package, some take a little more time to prepare and some are very quick and easy. So let's go ahead and get to that. Okay, so first off, I wanna let you know that everything I'm talking about today came from Walmart unless I tell you otherwise. So for the Progressive Light Chicken Noodle Soup, one can contains two cups and these Progresso soups, they do have a lot of sodium in them. So if this is something that affects your weight loss, you may wanna pass on this. For one and a half cups of the Progresso Light Chicken Noodle Soup, it came out to 98 calories, 8.2 grams of protein, 14.2 grams of carbs, and 1.1 grams of fat. The other three options I'll talk about, I won't tell you what the parameters are. The next one had one cup of soup and 1.2 ounces of grilled chicken breast strips. Now the chicken breast strips that I purchased, I got from Costco, and um, they are pre-cooked and ready to eat. So I measured it out and I just tore it up and put it in my soup and heated up my soup. But I did notice that they do have something very similar to this at Walmart and also at the Smith's grocery store. The third option is you can have one cup of the soup with three fourths of a light stream cheese. It's the F-R-I-G-I-O brand. I'm not quite sure how to pronounce that. I use that one specifically because their string cheese is only 50 calories. Not all of them are created the same. There are some brands that are light string cheese, but the string cheese is 80 calories. So I did want you to be aware of that. And the last option is one cup of chicken noodle soup with one half hard boiled egg. The other progressive soup that I tried out was the Italian style wedding soup. I had one cup of that with one half of a string cheese. It came out to 105 calories, 11 grams of carbs, seven grams of protein, and three and a half grams of fat. There are some other light versions of the Progresso soup. I haven't tried the others, so I haven't shared them with you at this time. The third thing that I have up for you today is probably my favorite out of all of them. It tasted like I was cheating. It was a grilled chicken, tomato, and spinach roll up. So I started off with um, one half of a flat out light original, one and a half ounces of the Kirkland grilled chicken breast strips. Again, this is something that you can get at Walmart. They have their own kind or Smith's. 0.2 ounces of spinach, 1.3 ounces of chopped tomato, and two tablespoons or less of your favorite Walden Farms dressing. I use the Caesar flavor for mine. It came out to 109 calories, 13 grams of carbs, 15 grams of protein, and two grams of fat. Next up is a spaghetti squash pizza. I called it a pizza because it has some turkey pepperoni, but I didn't mix it up together for mine. Um, I had one third cup of the frozen spaghetti squash. Um, that's very convenient. Um, you can steam it, and you can microwave it in the bag. I personally prefer the fresh spaghetti squash, but I do have a son who absolutely loves these. 
Um, as many of you know, two of my sons also wanted to lose weight. Um, this particular one loves noodles. He was always eating noodles. I had him try the spaghetti squash. He likes this better than the fresh, but um, he's lost over 25 pounds now and um, used this and palmini noodles to replace the noodles that he normally eats. I just had to tell you that as a side note. Just um, really impressed with him. Um, along with that spaghetti squash, I had two tablespoons of Victoria marinara sauce, 16 turkey pepperoni, and two pistachios. It came out to 110 calories, 6 grams of carbs, 10 grams of protein, and 5 grams of fat. This one is a very, very simple one. It's fat-free cottage cheese. You can have 2 thirds cup, and it's 107 calories, 7 grams of carbs, 19 grams of protein, and 0 grams of fat. And lastly, One Veggie's Made Great Superfood Veggie Cake. This is different from the one that I showed you in a previous video. That The one I showed you in a previous video was the same brand, but it was spinach egg white frittata. And um, with this, I put one ounce of turkey breast. It came out to 110 calories, 9.5 grams of carbs, 9 grams of protein, 5.2 grams of fat. I thought this was very tasty. I think I like the spinach one the best, but this was also very good. I hope all of you have a wonderful day, and until next time.